I think it's quite an empowering statement in the sense that it empowers us to be united as women. So when I hear the, the statement, she moves us, I don't think about myself. I think about the women I work with um, and how they inspire me. It's probably not easy to be true to yourself because people want you to be something that you're not. I think I just always have to remind myself that who I am is good enough. It's not for me to catch up with their expectations, it's for them to catch up with who I am. I've had a lot of experiences in this, this short lifetime of mine. Um, and the most important thing is to have your own back because you're going to face so many hurdles along the way, more than our male counterparts. So you've got to believe in yourself. And if you don't believe in yourself, other people won't. So back yourself 100%. The best way to describe when you're racing is kind of like all the sound turns off and you're just really living the moment and not really thinking about anything other than what's happening on the piece of tarmac right in front of you. My first race, I didn't actually want to participate in the race. I found the whole thing quite intimidating because no one around me looked like what I looked like. My dad threw me into the deep end and said, we're just going to do it. Uh, so I was actually really nervous and I wasn't looking forward to it, but I really enjoyed myself. I came out with a big smile on my face and never looked back.